I was born and grew in the Republic of Lithuania in 1932. It was the period of uh, restored statehood of Lithuania when we refer to the ancient uh, kingdom and grand duchy of Lithuania from 13th to end of 18th century after what Lithuania was captured, annexed by Tsar, Tsarist Russia, the M Russian Empire, and became self-liberated and due to opportunities at the end of the First World War, uh, due to famous declaration of self-determination of nations by President Hoover, and as it was implemented in many countries, Lithuania succeeded as well to proclaim itself a restored independent state in ethnic boundaries, not in such a great territories of previous <laughs> expansionist Lithuania. Uh, and then Lithuania had to defend itself from Tolls greater neighbors, uh, which uh, did not want to have any independent Lithuania, only uh, their own province. Uh, so Lithuania again was quite successful to defend itself, it became a member of League of Nations, an independent European country, uh, until 1940. Uh, 40, uh, when it fell victim of um, conspiracy or criminal uh, agreement between Hitler and Stalin, as they began to divide uh, nations among them, uh, this way initiating the Second World War. So I was born in pre-war times in the First Republic of Lithuania. Uh, uh, I remember still, and I remember it later, uh, at those times of my uh, childhood and being a boy and pupil of primary school when, and uh, those events when Soviet occupation came, the Soviet tanks on the streets of my native town, and oppression which was felt everywhere, including the uh, violence and uh, uh, no, mass deportations of the people, uh, what is known from history. Uh, so this uh, sad and sometimes brave history, because it was led by uh, moves of resistance of Lithuanians, uh, disagreeing with the occupations, either Soviet or German Nazis, and then again Soviet, uh, reoccupation from 1944, uh, with a memory and to wish, sometimes looked like a dream, uh, to be an independent European democratic country again. Uh, this was preserved in my family, um, uh, as in many other families of Lithuanians. Uh, therefore, when after, I could say, uh, the long-standing armed resistance of Lithuanians in 1945-1955, uh, it was a long-standing war after the war against Soviet occupation. Uh, finally, it was crushed by much uh, greater prevailing force majeure <laughs> of Soviets.